Hey guys, it's Nerdo Live. That's right, guys. A new gameplay episode for today. Uh, so what we have here is Secret of Mana, uh, an old remaster. I guess it's a remaster or a remake. No, I think it's more of a remaster um, of a, the SNES Secret of Mana. Um, I think it has more 3D graphics now. 3D graphics. So. Um, so I guess it would be a remaster? I don't know. I'm not really sure. Remaster or uh, <laughs> or a remake. So, uh, but yeah, so this game has a lot of nostalgia factor for me. Because um, when I was at the elementary or middle school, uh, maybe fifth grade already, I was playing this game um, in the SNES. Um, during that time, it was very hard for me. Um, yeah, so um, I can't really wait to play this game. Alright, um, so let's start. Let's see. Say to this game, not English? English? Let me put it here. Near though. Let me see maybe if I could put the whole near though life. Near though live. No. Just near though. So. Near though it is. Alright. Long ago, the world prospered and humanity thrived thanks to a power known as man. However, humans soon sought to use mana to create the ultimate weapon, a floating oh. battleship called the Mana Fortress. This greedy arrogance angered the gods, who in turn unleashed vicious beasts into the world. Oh, okay. A violent war between the mana beasts and the fortress engulfed the world in poison and until mana had all but disappeared. In humanity's bleakest hour, a hero wielding the mana sword appeared and destroyed the fortress. The world was left in shambles, and yet humanity persevered, and there was peace throughout the land. But as time passes, so history repeats. That's a very powerful uh, quote. As time passes, re history repeats. Uh, very powerful. Hey, guys, wait. Quiet, stupid. If the elder finds us here, we're done for. Yeah. We're not supposed to be here. Everyone in the village knows about the ghost. You really believe that old fib? The grown-ups just say there's a ghost to scare us away. But I did hear Grandma say she saw something shiny by the falls when she was little. Maybe it's treasure. Let's go find it. Uh, help! I'm gonna fall! Ah! Back up. Now what am I gonna do? Hmm. Wow. Just look at this. It's pretty cool. Look at that. There's there's a map on the right. I don't remember that having being there in the 
in the SNES version. That's a good addition. Um, I like the graphics. It's pretty cool. But let me see. Wait, can I start? Holy moly. How do I save? All right, it doesn't let me do anything. So, all right, before we start, guys, through with the episode, please like and subscribe, and let me know in the comments down below what you, get, what you guys think of the game, the episode, or whatever you guys want to talk about. Just let me know. And as always, guys, um, throughout the new episodes that I've been doing um, lately, um, I'm doing what I call a subscriber of the day. Um, I want to give a shout out to one of my subscribers who has a channel uh, just to let everybody know you know that uh, to check out their channel because I want to spread the love of and uh, of the love and you know because of the just to, to <laughs> oh my god I don't know what's going on. I'm so tired today uh, yeah so you know spread the love and uh, introduce the gaming culture <laughs> To, to everybody, you know, like, um, it's very hard to to have a lot of, you know, to get get a momentum of subscribers. So, you know, this way, you know, because they're subscribed to me, I want to show all my other subscribers that's watching this to check out their channel. So, today's subscriber of the day is True Flight Gaming. All right, guys, I'll put in the description down below his channel. Um, I've been kind of lagged at some of my videos of putting the description uh, The channel in the description. <laughs> I'll, I'll do it <laughs> It's just that I, there's so I have so much uh, I've been so busy lately, so but I'll do it. Um, so guys true light true flight gaming true flight gaming guys check his channel pretty cool um, Right now. I think he's playing last of us 2 and uh, I think he was playing. Uh, what was it? I think. Well, what was? Because I was watching him stream. Uh, stream Last of Us. But I watched another episode too. That he did. Yeah, he was doing Last of Us. I think it was Final Fantasy that I watched him play. Yeah, it was Final Fantasy VII Remake. Yeah. So yeah, he was playing that. I was watching... Right now he's playing um, Last of Us 2, but I was watching also his Final Fantasy VII Remake. Yeah, so... As you all know, I'm a big RPG gamer fan. So, uh, yeah. So as for... Uh, let's go. Let's go back to the game. Um, so, um, Secret of Mana. So far, it looks really cool. Uh, from what I remember, you know, they made it more 3D. Um, now there's voiceover, so that's that's a good addition. And I like the graphics. Uh, so far, we, there's no gameplay yet. Uh, and I don't remember that first introduction of that how it was in in the game. What was it like that? That they introduced that, or that's like a new addition? I don't really remember. Um, if you're watching this, let me know in the comments down below if that was in the SNES. The thing is, I haven't played this game in a long time and I, w I actually wasn't able to finish it too. I got really, really far throughout the game, but I never got the chance to finish it because of, um, I was, because I was, during that time, you know, um, I couldn't afford to to get the game so I would have to borrow it I mean yeah borrow it from Blockbuster and I had, I had to play it that way so I had to ask my parents do chores all that stuff so I could just get what was it like a week worth or three days how, how, how did that work in in um in the old time oh There a thing. What suck is that? I can't control the music. I hope you can hear me, guys, while I'm talking. So, yeah, uh, I mean, uh, when I was young, yeah, that's why I think I, I was playing this when I was elementary. This way, but I'll never get through here without a weapon. 
Okay. Yeah, so uh, so I had to rent it from Blockbuster, and I had to, I think, I got so far t to the game, but then um, I couldn't afford to rent it again, so uh, I, I couldn't get money for um, my allowance, so it took me like, what, like a week or two weeks before getting this game, and when I got it back, some guy deleted my like my my profile and he uh oversaved my profile man so all that gameplay was gone and the thing is in our blockbuster there was only one uh cartridge of of secret of mana so yeah maybe that guy was so pissed at me <laughs> he erased my game so i was mad too let's see this yeah, I like the graphics. It's pretty nice. Take sword. Who are you? And what's a sword doing here? Too right. What's with this light? Yeah, so that guy, man. Oh, wow. Let's see. Okay. If I don't move. Okay. Yeah, I remember, like, there's no. The beginning you can't charge yet. So there's two sets a thrust and a slash. Okay. So, yeah, so I think the guy. <laughs> I mean, I think the guy was so mad, probably, that I, uh, cause I, I think I borrowed the game for like almost two, two weeks. So, um, he was mad. Maybe he was mad and he deleted it. He over... <laughs> Did you get stuff when you, like, Link of the Past? I don't remember. Yeah, so he over... Right. The data, man. I was so mad. Rabbi. Oh shoot. I swear there was like a thing here. Am I getting it? So sure. All right. But you can save and stuff mid game. I guess that's what sucks about this man. How do you save in this game? Ooh, chest. <laughs> but candy. Yeah, because I mean, wasn't there like a thing where I could equip it and stuff, man? I don't know, maybe it's still the beginning. Like, how can I heal myself? Options. So. Be 
put 70. It's kind of loud. Oh, voiceover is fine. Maybe 60. Kind of loud. Let me see you once I... This first episode, if it's thing. Share screen, game commands, title screen. That's it, right? Yeah. Okay, gear. Wow. Cool. What's this action grid? Attack enemies not targeted by allies. Alright. Rusty sword, orbs, level. Oh, it levels up. Yeah, right? I think those things don't. Monsters. Rabbi. Supposedly it tells you what it is. Weapons. Rusty sword. Map. Ah. Wow, I didn't know the world map was this small. <laughs> HP, next level. Targeting. What about the candy? How do I equip the candy? I'm still learning guys, sorry. So where's the item? I remember you could equip the rare candy. Still learning. Alright. Drop boxes where you could get items. Yeah, rare candy. So yeah, where can we equip the candy, man? Ah, there it is. You gotta press up. All right. Ah, there you go. Up. All right. Now I remember. Like the thing. Oh, snap. Nice. I think I remember, like, when you... mechanics here yeah so um, I waited to buy this game um, when it became I just bought it now actually because of um, 
It was on sale on Steam. This was, I think, $39.99. Kind of expensive. I mean, I know it, it's 3D already modeled and everything. I was like, I, I didn't want to buy it because I was hearing a lot of negativity about it. Um, but so far it's good. It's like, uh oh. Ooh, four gold. It's like the game so far of how I played it. So I don't know. Um, there's a voiceover now, which is nice. You know, it's not just um, clicking. But let's see, it's, it's still the beginning. So... I'm not gonna say anything yet. But I remember um, I would... Um, thing here. I will. Oh, candy won't fit anymore. Oh, shoot. There's a limit? Alright. Now, let's see. Status? No, action grid. What's that? Next level 19. I think there was a way to thing it too. Weapon level. I thought he leveled up. like how it is so far I just can't wait until I can start charging <laughs> all right let's go to the story I remember the first boss being very easy but we'll see I mean, I like I like how they did this this um, this 3D how they did this on 3D and you know oh let me use a candy. Drop rates here are nice. I don't remember it being this easy. And there's a dodging. Um, there's a dodging mechanic. When uh, you miss, the character actually dodges. That's just cool. Alright, I'm liking it. Ooh, okay. Wow. Well, each character here, they talk to you. The elder was looking for you. What did you do this time? What? It's a nice remaster. Oh, look at this guy. Yeah, even he's dancing. Look at that. Ah, oh, wow. An area don't dawdle. What'll it be? Let's see. What can I buy? Overall, so I got that already. Bandana, I guess. What's a couple wishes do? Anything else? What was that? This beat. Medicinal. 
Oh, it tells you up there, save a ghosted player. Ah, okay. Buy some medicinal herbs. Maybe two. Anything else? Come again. Maybe I should on an errand for the elf. Welcome. What'll it be? Maybe I can sell candy. Oh wow. Uh. Anything else? Come again. Look at that. Dang. This is a good I guess it's a remake, not a remaster. Oh look an in. No, same guy. Stay the night. No. Wow, but he has a different voice. Oh wait, I can oh this is how you save. Okay, okay. One night is five GP. Yes. Alright. Cool. So this I guess you save they use this an in mechanic. I forgot it was it was that way. Let me just get more candies. Candy. Oh. Whoa. What happened to them? Huh. Okay. Yes, that was a glitch. <laughs> I just hope it doesn't take my game. Looks like it's not a. It's not a, like a game-breaking glitch. Yeah, okay. Leveling up of the sword. Oh, that's the max, I guess. Alright. That's the item shop. And this is. Monsters have surrounded the village. Oh, wow. We better stay inside until we know what's going on out there. Wow, each character has their... What, you little kid? There's a familiar face in here. It looks kind of scary. I don't know. Oh. I think that guy is a knight. What's he doing in a little village like ours? Okay. It'd be nice if I could oh, see his face. Too. Elliot just stopped by, but he didn't look too good. But what happened? Hmm. Like I wish, like they would think it. Like a uh, character portrait. Be cool. They had a character portrait. Hey, stop playing with that sword before you hurt someone. Nick, like for uh, imp important characters. They should have added that. That'd be cool. It's good already. It's good as it is. Oh, are you all right? Elliot just told me what happened. Well, I thought you were a goner. That's why I told you not to bring someone like him along. You idiots! None of you were supposed to wander into that area. Uh, what's that you have there? Oh no! It couldn't be. Cool. Did you find the treasure? Way to go! <laughs> What have you done? That's the mana sword. There's no way you could have pulled it free. Mana sword? But legend says the village will be destroyed if it's removed. Uh oh. I knew 
never thought it'd come to this. The mana sword is said to protect the village from disaster. But now... Aha! So you're the reason all those monsters are attacking us! You yanked out the sword and doomed the whole village! It's your fault, you outsider! Huh. Nope. Hey, stop! What? Oh yeah, and the character talks too. <laughs> Even shakes. Help! I'm a monster. You have a sword. Why don't you use it? Man, this Elliot guy pissed me off. <laughs> Can you hear me? Calm down and study the enemy's movement to look for an opening. Oh wow! Uh oh, how did he get hit? <laughs> Look at that guy quivering in fear. Yay! Ooh, you did well. Wait there, I'll pull you up. Stay back. I didn't do nothing. You seem to be in possession of the real mana sword. This is troubling. Why is that? Legend says the sword can only be retrieved by a knight when the world is in peril. But you are far too young for such a responsibility. Something must be wrong with the mana sword. Here, you take it. No, I cannot. The sword has lost its power must be restored. Only the one who pulled it free can do that. Then what should I do? Visit Sage Luca in the Water Palace. The Sage has protected these lands for over 200 years. You would do well to listen to her advice. Hey! The Elder wants you to come to his house. I'll be off. I have duties to attend. My name is Jimma, and I'll be waiting for you at the Water Palace. It's kind of weird. I mean, I don't remember the story anymore. It's kind of weird that a knight is in the village at the moment where I pick up the sword. <laughs> Was there like stuff in pots? We can't ignore this. We're at a wit's end. Who knows when another monster will appear? Hmm. Oh, it's you. You've really done it this time. That sword has protected us for years. Once you removed it, the monster started attacking the village. It's settled. We can't let him stay in the village anymore. He'll just bring more monsters. It's kind of dumb. <laughs> the sword doesn't thing the monsters. It protects you guys, right? So I should be with the village to defend the village. 
You're not gonna disappear if I leave. Go. Get out of here. Yeah, leave here now. now. <sighs> I don't want to do this, but I have no choice. I banish you from this village. There's a treasure chest downstairs. Take the contents and be on your way. Oh yeah, you know what? I didn't I didn't wear the bandana. <laughs> How do you wear it again? How do you wear it? There you go. Plus two, plus twenty three, wait, oh my gosh. See what treasures we can get. Are you going somewhere? See you later. Oh, look at the details of that sword and the portrait. You know, that's a cool addition. Is that me? No, it can't be me. He looks like a knight. Fifty gold. That's it. I thought I gotta give me some something nice. Just gold. <laughs> I took you in as a child, but there's nothing more I can do for you. You wouldn't remember. You were just a baby. But I was there when your mother first came to this village. After she disappeared, I did my best to raise you. But today is the day we must part ways. I hope that you find your mother again someday. Goodbye. Near <laughs> Nice. So the hero journey begins. Let's talk to the villagers a little bit. See if they still hate me. I'll be kind of lonely, but it's all your fault anyway. Oh gosh. This is all because you removed the sword. Go away. Man. People can be mean. In game and in real life. <laughs> Uh, it's all because you removed the sword. Go away. Look at that, man. We're in danger as long as you're here. Please leave. People in real life would actually act like this. At first, when I was a kid, I wouldn't know what they were talking about, but now, oh man. I'm only selling you stuff because the elders said I had to. When you're done. Get out of here. Oh wow, look at that. <laughs> Welcome. What'll it be? Well he, he sounded when you got you take my money, you're nice and all, right? <laughs> Anything else? You have to equip the armor before it'll have any effect. Got it? Now scram. Hey. He's still a kid though, man. It's not even an adult and they're like treating him like Let's save. It makes me cry. One night is five GP. Stay the night. Oh, at least he's nice. This sucks. I can only have two saving spots. You gotta be kidding me. All right, let me out of here. Do you have everything you need? Screw you, man. Order of the Elder, you have been banished from Poto's village. Now be gone. Can I go back? Order of the Elder, you have been. I changed my mind. I want to come back. <laughs> Let's see if I can come back again. Maybe it resets. Hold on, hold on. Let's see. Man, look at a rabbi. By order of the Elder, you have been banished from Poto's village. Now be gone. Wow. Damn. They really banished me. For reals. Oh, so it's only 20. Cannon Travel Center. What is that? Oh, yeah, that's when you. Same thing, right? Hi. We, the Cannon Travel Brothers, are building a global network. Going to the Water Palace? Gemma's already left. It only takes one blast to get there by cannon. And Gemma's paid your way. Pop it. You sure? 
Well, okay. If you want to walk to the Water Palace, head west. Hmm, let's walk our way. Oh shoot. <laughs> let's travel. Yeah, the mushrooms. I remember this. What's down here? Of treasure you got for me. Ooh, medical, medical herb. Okay, so he gives medical herbs. <laughs> Nothing here. Ooh, what's that? This addition to the right is nice. Really helps a lot. <clears throat> uh, I think in the old days in the SNS you could thing this. You could slash it so it goes away. Boom. Alright. <laughs> I see. All right. Yeah, I think that's how it was. I kind of remember the map, like how it is. Not going west. <laughs> What's here? Poto's village, Kingdom of Pandora. Okay. Not bad, it's free roaming. You're not from our town. By order of the king, we can't allow outsiders in. Now, get moving. Ah, look at that, they have a lot of voiceovers. Some different voice, not just like... So, they really want me to go there. They'll go. I don't like this, I can't charge attack. So use that charge attack mechanics. Ha! 
because there's a tree. Can I get this apple tree? No. Let's see. Danger, beware of goblins. Goblins. This is a new addition of an enemy. I don't remember these flowers. I remember the mushrooms. And the rabbites. Ooh, nice. Holy moly. Nekos. What's Nekos? Neko! Oh yeah, that's right. It means cat. <laughs> Welcome to Neko. Do you need anything? What you got? Oh, knew you're interested. Sure. Perfectly priced items available. Ooh, rest then. Rabbi cap. Hair ribbon. Nine hundred gold. Cover some P. Full HP. Her thing. Oh look, it's a flashing. There's a flashing thing if you can wear it. I guess I can wear a wristband. Let me buy this one. Anything else? Seeing you. Yeah, meow. Welcome to Neko's. Let me. Oh, you're interested. 30 GP. Holy moly. Just want to save. Screw that. 30 gold. It's 5 gold in my place. I mean, I got banished, but. <laughs> I thought there was like secret stuff in here somewhere, but I guess not. Um, so. I guess I'll end the episode here, and then we'll go to the next episode, will be the Water Palace, you know. Um, so, thank you guys for watching. Please like and subscribe. Let me know in the comments down below what you guys think of the episode, the game, and all that fun stuff. And please check out my subscriber, True Flight Gaming. Alright guys, that's it for the episode. Watch again for an episode 2 of Secret of Mana. Bye bye guys.